Hello everyone. Today we are going to take a look at some replication command we can use to fix replication issues in our Active Directory environment. Okay, let's jump into my testing domain controller here and check a quick health. Now let's check on replications. I'm going to type the command rep admin space for slash show repl and hit enter. This is going to show me the replication between my domain controllers. So you can see I have two domain controllers in my environment and let's do a quick force replication too. Just to make sure the replication is working in a real time between domain controllers. Okay, so the replication is successful. This is a good indication that replication between my domain controllers are working properly. I will show you that we are going to simulate a failure. So you may see something like RPC server unavailable. RPC server unavailable is the most common error message we can see when there is a replication issue. So let's take a look at uh, one more command before we do this. So I can show you what it looks like when it's working like we saw earlier. We are going to type the command rep admin repl summary which is the replication summary. And this will show you if there have been any failure within the last few replications. Okay, now I'm going to disconnect or disable my network card of uh, domain controller 2. Now I am going to go back to my DC1 and make sure I cannot ping it. And I can't. Next we are going to go to our command prompt and try to do a replication. Or we can use the Active Directory site and services. Also, there will be events in the event viewer. First, let's try this on Active Directory site and services. Basically, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a force replication. We are going to force it go sooner so we can see what's happened during failures. And it should come up with an error. There we go. Now you can see the error. You can see it says the RPC server is unavailable. Which you will see this error in the command we are going to run again. Okay, now let's do the command line replications too. We should be able to see the same result. So normally when it comes to the replication uh, issues like RPC server unavailable, that means communication is not available. This could be either physical disconnection, that means DC offline or firewall level port block. This is just simulating if your domain controls are offline. There are other errors and things that come up due to domain control offline, not only the replications. But I just wanted to let you know how easy it was to use this command to troubleshoot. Let's run the application commands.
we can see the RPC server is unavailable error. Let's connect our network card again and make the replication normal again. If you are a person who is responsible for your Active Directory environment, you will need to run this command in your environment just to make sure there are no surprises or no errors. You know, if you have a big environment, you know it's possible. You may or may not pick up it on right away. So just a good thing to check once in a while. If you are not comfortable of running PowerShell or Command Prompt for whatever reason, Microsoft has a GUI tool called AD Replication Status Tool, which basically does the same thing. You can simply use it, use that tool. Hopefully, these commands and tools will help you to diagnose replication issues in your Active Directory environment. So, thank you for watching. Have a nice day.